Hello, my lovely friends. Welcome to video 27 of our 30 video playlist series talking about how to start a raw vegan diet. Now, today's video is going to be talking about detox symptoms. We did mention this in one of the earlier videos, but I wanted to create a video just for the detox symptoms because I've noticed a lot of people are experiencing what they think is detox when in reality it's actually under eating. So let's talk about that in this video. Thank you so much for joining me today. We're on day 27 of our 30 video playlist series. I am so grateful and appreciative for all the love, the great comments and your compassionate choices. Thank you for making those good choices, voting with your dollar and eating healthier. You are a great example to those around you and to yourself. You're keeping those promises to yourself. It's beautiful. So before we begin, just to mention, we've got 40% off any or all of our raw vegan recipe books. The code is NiceCream40. The link is here and in the description box below, along with the link for all of our print versions. This is the plant-based dips and dressings. This is one of the most popular. Check out that sweet chili sauce. This is made with orange juice, you guys. Orange juice. And we've got some, some delicious dressings here. I really like this one. Barbecue mustard. Yum, yum, yum. If you want to grab any of these, the link for the Amazon print versions is down below. Remember, the code does not work on Amazon, just on the ebooks. 40% off, ice cream 40. So let's talk a little bit about detox. Something that people experience when they go raw is detox symptoms. Now, of course the body's going to be detoxing. The body detoxes and cleanses every day when we get out of the way. And when we stop putting foods in that are preventing our body from functioning at its highest. But not all detox symptoms are actually detox. And I've noticed this over and over again, talking to thousands of people, when they move over, they start experiencing some symptoms that they think is detox. And I've observed over the years that detox tends to be used to explain all kinds of things when it shouldn't be. If you're experiencing nutritional deficiency, if you are under eating and you have irritability, tiredness, muscle aches, sluggishness, cravings, and roller coaster emotions, feeling sad, feeling blue, or if you're just thinking about food a lot, it's probably not detox. It's likely that you're under eating. And again, like I mentioned, I'm going to say this over and over and over again. You have to eat enough when you are on a raw diet. So many detox symptoms are actually under eating symptoms, but people like to use the word detox to explain anything that's not very explainable. Like they don't know why they have this reaction. They don't know why they're tired, but they're eating raw. It must be detox. They don't know why they're feeling this way when they're eating raw, so it must be detox. It's not always detox. So if you are experiencing anything that you think might be detox, you could do a couple things to see if you can relieve those symptoms. Number one, you want to eat more food. Number two, of that more food that you're eating, you're going to want to eat more greens. So there are theories going around that adding more greens to your diet stops detox. That's why the symptoms seem to go away. The thing is, is that greens provide your body with fiber to feed your good bacteria. They also provide with protein and minerals and a lot of other things that you don't really get if you're under eating or you're just eating fruit. We do need greens. Greens are extremely important for human health. So adding more food and adding more greens can really help. Greens do not slow or stop detox. The reason why the symptoms seem to go away is because greens facilitate detox. So greens are actually beneficial if you are experiencing those symptoms and it actually is detox. We want to add more greens to help pull those toxins out of the body. The chlorophyll, the fiber, all the good stuff. 
we want to help pull those toxins out of the body so we're not experiencing all these symptoms. So make sure that you add more fiber. When I was working in the natural health industry at the health food store, I was constantly told that if somebody goes on a cleanse, they're going to need extra fiber because the fiber helps to pull the toxins out of the body. It doesn't stop detox, it helps detox. So increase those greens. If you're feeling you're having a little bit of detox symptoms, it could be either it's detox or you're not eating enough, but in either case, adding more greens and more food to your diet is going to help that out. Don't forget to increase your hydration as well. Even though we are on a raw diet, you're still gonna wanna drink water. I know there's people out there who disagree with me that we can get all the water we need from our fruits and vegetables. And yes, fruits and vegetables have the best form of water. That's the best of all. It's synergistic, it's the way nature intended it, and we are going to get extremely hydrated from that, but we still need to drink water. We still need to drink water. The best water that I feel is just the cleanest water that you wanna drink with lemon juice added to it, fresh lemon juice to help with internal cleansing and also detox, <laughs> daily detox. The detox that the body does all on its own every day. So increase that hydration. It's really going to help if you're experiencing any kinds of symptoms that could be detox. But again, eat more food. Eat more food is so essential. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please click like, subscribe to the channel to get notifications for more. You can click the little bell that'll be sent directly to you whenever I post a new video. 40% off code is NICECREAM40. That's off our eBooks. The link is right here, as well as in the description box below along with the link for all of our print versions. You can get the print versions of our recipe books on Amazon. There's some deliciousness in here. So if you're looking for the one that you can hold in your hands, you can grab those from Amazon. The code unfortunately doesn't work for the Amazon print books, just for the eBooks, but all the goodies down below in the description box. And till the next video guys. Mwah. I love you so much and fruit on.